I think it's time for our first actual Edgar Award here. Those little guys over there, they're all like, not enough. All right, Edward Zuckerman has won two Edgars and an Emmy for his work on Law and Order. Dun, dun, dun. He's also written for Blue Buds. Do they have a sound effect, like a heart beating or something? Anyhow, who better to present the Edgar Award for Best Television Episode, Edward Zuckerman. Well, it was a pleasure to read the many nominees we had in this category, uh, and it was a very tight race. You'll see in a minute that we actually have six, not five, finalists because there was a, a tie along the way. Uh, also interesting to, for me to see that the entries came from a wide variety of outlets. Uh, at least two came from the broadcast television network. Does anyone remember those? Uh, and. Uh, yeah, one other thing distinguishing this group of nominees, unlike all the others, is that the writers who are nominated tonight, uh, we all belong to a labor union. As a result of that, uh, and those of you who are not in a union may want to brace yourselves, not fall out of your chairs, uh, we get things like uh, health insurance and a pension plan. Uh, it also means that as of Monday, we may be on strike. Uh, we don't know yet. Negotiations are, come good, are going down to the wire, as they always do. The main issue is that the studios, which earn billions of dollars in profits every year, as they tell their shareholders, uh, tell us that they're broke. Uh, two of our nominees who are here tonight are actually British writers uh, who have flown over, and we're very had they're happy uh, to have them here. Uh, the British, uh, the Great Britain Writers uh, Guild has uh, vowed support for our strike if, if it happens and vowed not to take work from that would otherwise go to American writers. Um, you two, are you, are, are you guys with us, where we are? <laughs> okay, good, I'll, I'll, I'll take that as a yes. Okay, the nominees are uh, the, uh, episode One Mighty and Strong from the show Under the Banner of Heaven, written by Brandon Boyce. Episode one of The Magpie Murders, written by Anthony Horowitz. <laughs> Episode one, uh, same title, of uh, Karen Perry, written by Emer Kenny. <laughs> the episode titled When Harry Met Fergus, of the show Harry Wilde, written by David Logan. An episode of Blue Bloods called The Reagan Way, written by Siobhan Byrne O'Connor. <laughs> an episode of Law and Order Special Victims Unit called 18 Wheels of Predator, written by Brianna Yellen, Kathy Doby, and Monet Hurst Mendoza. <laughs> and the Edgar goes to Anthony Horowitz. who is coming up right now. Congratulations. Thank you very much. I'm, I'm in shock. Um, I, just want to, I just want to thank three amazing women who were behind Magpie Murders. The first was Leslie Manville, who came in the show very early. And when you've got her as your, as your lead actress, it doesn't matter what you write. It's going to be great on the screen. You could give her a bag of letters out of Scrabble, and she'd still make them fantastic. <laughs> Uh, the second woman is my wife, Jill Green, uh, who was also the producer of the show. And I want to thank her for telling me that the first episode was, the first draft was terrible. <laughs> the, the second draft was worse. <laughs> the third draft was you're fired. The fourth draft was you're hired again. And the fifth draft was why didn't you listen to me in the first place? <laughs> uh, amazing woman. And the third uh, woman behind this is uh, Suzanne Simpson, who's with me here tonight from Masterpiece Theatre, who makes some of the greatest drama for American television. There's one thing an English writer like me fears, and that's notes from across the Atlantic. They're always going to screw your head. But her notes were always spot on, wonderful, and so positive and so helpful. She should really be here standing with me to accept this. But thank you very much. What a wonderful evening. Thank you. Is that it? Thank you.